The Florida State Golf Association is proud to announce the 2020 Senior and Super Senior Players of the Year. Both players had fantastic seasons highlighted with big victories. The Senior Player of the Year is Paul Royak, and the most decorated player 65 years or older is David Anthony. Congratulations, gentlemen. Paul Royak picked up Senior Player of the Year honors after an outstanding 2020 season that included two FSGA championship wins. Paul captured top finishes in 2020, taking home a runner-up finish at the Senior Amateur Championship at Eagle Creek Golf and Country Club in October. He added a round of 16 appearance at the Senior Amateur Match Play in June, while finishing in the top 25 at the 40 and Over Championship in July. 2020 was a crazy year. Uh, my preparation for golf started uh, last year, 2019. I qualified for the U.S. Senior Amateur, gave me a little bit of confidence. Uh, this was going to be my first full year as a senior golfer. So I was going to focus on playing a lot of FSGA events, um, uh, had some success uh, early on and then COVID hit. A uh, big thank you to the FSGA for putting a schedule together so we could uh, continue play. Uh, I played well pretty much th throughout the whole year. I played pretty consistent, got better, a little bit better and better as, as the year went on. Um, really looking forward to 2021 to uh, continue some good play. The highlights of Paul's season came with Brian Keenan by his side. The two players took home two FSGA championship victories this season. Paul and Brian came out on top in the senior division at both the two-man scramble and the foursomes championship. They also finished runner-up at the 14 over four ball and the senior four ball. A golf mentor of mine, uh, Raymond Porter, in uh, Pine Haven Country Club in New York told me when I was just starting out in the game, the first rule in golf is pick a good partner. And uh, luckily, uh, Brian Keenan and I have been uh, golf partners now for a long time. <laughs> we first met each other when we were teenagers up in upstate New York. Uh, we reconnected down here and, and uh, have been had the opportunity to win a couple FSGA events. Uh, this year we, we won the, uh, the senior scramble, the, the uh, senior foursome, and finished runner-up in the, uh, the senior four ball. So uh, it's a great opportunity to play with great friends um, and looking forward to doing that again in 2021. Paul ended his season at the 103rd Amateur Championship at Black Diamond Ranch in December. The 56-year-old qualified for the championship at Seminole Legacy Golf Club. Paul was one of only five senior players to compete in the championship that week. Uh, starting back at the qualifying up at Seminole Legacy, um, I put a solid round together there playing with you know a couple 18-year-olds and uh, really set my confidence up that I could compete with some of those younger guys. So I was kind of looking forward to Black Diamond. Uh, I played there before several times. I played there in the 1991 state amateur and finished 28th, I believe. So the reason I got into the state amateur this year was I was trying to chase the points list for the uh, the senior player of the year. And uh, two of the two of the other guys that were real close, Pete Williams and, and Rick Kerper, were also playing in the state am. So I feel that's why I entered to see if I could keep pace with them on the points list. Um, well, mission accomplished there. But uh, started out great uh, the first two rounds, 72-69. Hit the ball really good the second day. Could have been better, um, of course. Uh, and then the third day, played with a couple of young guys, uh, hitting it you know, 30 yards past me. Uh, eagled the last hole, shoot 73. Still in fifth place. Um, so after two days, tied for the lead. Three days, fifth place. You know, Just looking for a solid round in day four. Uh, get a nice top 10. Uh, would have been nice, slipped a, bit, a little bit on the last nine holes. So, you know, tie for 24th was a little disappointing, but like I said, at the beginning of the week, I probably would have taken it. He had a great showing at the amateur, holding a share of the 36 hole lead after posting a second round 69. The Tampa native finished the tournament in a tie for 24th. Being 2020 uh, Florida State Golf Association Senior Player of the Year is a great honor. There's a, a lot of good players out there. Um, I'd like to thank uh, my family foremost for uh, giving me the opportunity to play. Um, I'd like to thank uh, Brian Keenan for uh, supplying some of the points for me. And uh, really our seasons were not that much different other than around here or there. So uh, congratulations to him on a great year also. Uh, but really looking forward to 2021. I'd like to thank the uh, Florida State Golf Association for, for getting us through 2020 in this COVID mess 
and uh, being able to put on all these tournaments and, and supplying some great competition for, for the golfers of Florida. And uh, a big thank you to Jim Demick for uh, his years of service for uh, the FSGA and the tremendous amount he's done for, uh, for golf in Florida. David Anthony earned Super Senior Player of the Year honors after a season that saw top finishes and an FSGA championship victory. David raised the trophy at the Super Senior Amateur Championship in October in wire-to-wire -wire fashion. It was his first FSGA individual title since the 2002 Mid-Amateur Championship. The Jacksonville native added a top six finish at the Senior Amateur Championship while also finishing tied for 11th at the 40 and over championship. I'd like to personally thank the Florida State Golf Association for making this year happen. In March, uh, we didn't even know if we'd have a season, uh, but you guys put it together and uh, what a season, kudos to you guys. Personally, I've had a, as a good year. One of my goals this year was to shoot my age. This month, I did shoot 65 for my first time. Also won the 2020 Super Senior Championship, which I was not expecting. The week before, I had a horrible week, and I went into the tournament for 80, thinking that if I could just play solid golf, and that was my goal to play solid golf, and I happened to win. Which uh, the last time I won an individual championship here at the Florida State Golf Association was 2002. So I'm, I'm, I'm very honored to, to be a champion, and I'm also very honored to be player of the year. Uh, again, I'd like to thank the Florida State Golf Association for uh, all the years I've played and everything you do, particularly for the junior, junior program. 